All right, in this video, we are going to be looking at the famous letter E slide. Almost every class that uses microscopes will start with the letter E, just a piece of, you know, uh, from newsprint, wherever. I can give you the details on an activity to do this yourself. But I'm looking at, when I put the slide onto the stage, the E was right side up. It was facing the way that it would look if I was reading it. And here you see that it's upside down and backwards. So that's one of the reasons we like to use this letter E, because it shows you that as the light rays are bent or refracted through a microscope, you're actually seeing a, a mirror image. So just like as I as I move the stage of the uh, to the right here, you're seeing the letter E move to the left and vice versa. So everything is backwards. That's okay. I'll go into the mechanics of that. But uh, I just wanted you to see this just um, as a reminder of why we use this activity. So I will go ahead and go to the next power because the main thing I want to cover in this video is your field of view and how much smaller it gets as we move uh, to higher and higher powers. So this is why it's very important to center whatever you're looking at in the middle of the, the field of view. So this large circle on the edge, which you can't see, but the entire circle I'm looking at is the field of view. Right now I'm using the scanning power, which is the 4x objective for a total magnification of 40 on this microscope. As I then jump to the low power, as you can see here, I'll get her tweaked a little bit and moved, but you can barely see uh, the, le the entire letter E here. And that's because as I just jumped from the 4x objective with a total magnification of 40 to the 10x low power objective with a magnification of 100, uh, my magnification went up two and a half times. So my field of view is now two and a half times smaller. Then as we move forward, and I'm going to go to the high drive power and get to a total magnification of 400x, you're only seeing part of a letter E, and I can fiddle with the light a little bit here, move this around a little bit, but as you can, you can clearly see, you're only seeing part of a letter E, and that's because as I jumped from a total magnification of 100 to a total magnification of 400, so obviously the magnification went up four times, and the field of view just dropped four times. So that's why we use the letter E, to show us those two things, that uh, the, the field of view is going to be greatly diminished every, every time you increase magnification, which is why it's so important to center whatever you're interested in looking at. And number two, the fact that what we're actually looking at here is a, is an image that's a that's a mirror image of what we actually put on our stage. All right, I hope that helps.